Hi guys and welcome back to a new episode of A Girl's Reflections. And the topic of today is how to overcome the fear of failure and why we need to take the first step. We all feel this fear before we even act. That fear that pops into our heads almost automatically even before we take the first step. It's a feeling that stops us, that holds us back as if it if it were saying, what if you fail? But deep down, if we look deep inside ourselves, we realize that the solution is right there inside us. Because we are the ones who have to have the willpower to move forward. We are the ones who need the courage to take that step and silence our fear. How many times do we find ourselves thinking, I'm afraid this is going to go wrong? When in fact, It could go incredibly well in a way we can't even imagine. It's as if we we are always exaggerating the negative scenarios and never considering that the other side, the one that tells us, what if it goes well? What if you fly? If there were a way to predict the future and know that so many of the things we worry about will actually turn out well, we wouldn't be so stuck in this fear. But that's our role, that's our task in life. It's our responsibility to show that we are strong. It's our responsibility to believe before we even see things happening. It's almost like a test. Only those who can overcome fear can achieve their dreams. Because what happens when we let fear take over? We miss opportunities. We become immobile, paralyzed. And so we never take the first step never get closer to our dreams. And ironically, life can bring us incredible moments, but if we are dominated by fear, we will never see them happen. It seems unfair, doesn't it? But it's reality. If we don't take risks, if we don't believe wonderful things could be happening right now in front of us, and we won't be there to see them, now it is important to recognize that Overcoming a fear is not something that happens overnight, of course. Um, It is difficult, that's the truth. And it requires strength and resilience from us that we often don't even know we have. But there is a thought that may help. That is, what if you fail? What if things go wrong? Even so, it will not be the end of the world. Because if something goes wrong, you will learn from the situation. And even when everything seems to be falling apart, you will find a way out. You will look for a new opportunity. You will have to keep acting. Life does not stop and you will have to keep looking for paths and solutions because you need to live, you need to survive. So one way or another, whether things go well or badly, you will always turn things around. And no, it is not the end of the world. Life will go on whether you like it or not. So leave fear aside. If you make a mistake, find a new path, a new opportunity. If the situation doesn't work out for you, jump to another one because in the end, fear only serves to remind us of one thing. We have to take the first step because those who stand still lose the chance to live, to grow, and to fly. And that's all for today. This is the message of this episode. I hope you enjoyed listening to this little episode. And that's it. See you in the next one. Bye.